Hi, Sweet Coconuts. Welcome to Sweet Coconut Entertainment. I'm your host, Almond Joy K. And today we're going to do a reading on what makes you so good. Okay, so I have three stones to choose from. Stone one, stone two, stone three. And just take your time to meditate with a stone. All right. So we're going to start with stone one and this reading is called what makes you so good and guys hopefully this message resonates for you and thank you for watching make sure to like and subscribe to this page if this resonates thank you Spirit, what makes stone one so good? <clears throat> stone one, what makes stone one so good? Spirit, right. of swords so far. <clears throat> I'm getting I don't play energy. Let's see, what makes power one stone one so good? Seven of swords. being called to take that card <clears throat> and we got king of wands at the bottom Alrighty. so pile one stone one what makes you so good so what makes you so good what i'm already getting is like some of you guys are already like are attractive but let's start with the seven of swords <clears throat> with the seven of swords i think what makes you so good is no, I'm not going to say thing. What makes you so good is when you move in silence. Like you just be doing things sneaky. Like don't nobody know your moves you making. You just be making moves and just going about your business. Don't nobody know what's do what you got going on. They be wanting to know what you got going on. They be talking shit about you, trying to figure out what you're doing, but that's just you minding your business, moving, still shining still shining with the sun still doing you this is what makes you so good you be shining on these motherfuckers like you just be sending your power um excuse me it don't matter if you are male or female you be standing in your power that's why i said the queen of swords came out first what makes you so good is you know how to get that bag you know how to go for what you want with the king of wands at the bottom like you have the passion and energy to the drive to the ambition to go and get that money okay and when you is out there getting that money you make sure ain't nobody fucking like you make sure ain't nobody trying to fuck you over at the same time too you are very intelligent you're very smart you're very witty you're wise you know what the fuck you be on you know what you be talking about and people can't try to play you so that's what's making you so good <clears throat> also what makes you so good i know it's not all like good good but i mean like i said i heard you are attractive so you may break hearts you may have people in their feelings all the fucking time you know you got people from your past still wanting you and shit <clears throat> the only reason why i got past because it's dead back there so it's like and what's this the three of swords yeah so it's like dead, dead shit. And motherfuckers just still holding on to you, still wanting you. And like, because your energy, your vibe is just like out there. You out there with your energy, your vibe, you just doing you. And this was making you so good. And it's attracting people to you. But I mean, they stuck on you. This is what making you so good because you got people really stuck on you. Really just because they just watching and seeing how you moving. The things that you do and they like just... A, like a paw like i mean is it a paw well who knows what the fuck it is but they just like amazed like wow this person is really out here doing their thing let's see what else makes you so good what i say with the fool you be out here just doing what the fuck you gotta do king of wands still at the bottom you be out here taking chances and like you don't be giving a fuck you just be out here 
doing what you do, making those moves, whatever's going to make you happy in life. That's just what's making you so good right now. So let's see. And we're going to use some Oracle cards just to clarify what I said. And also we're just going to go in with some um, descriptions and initials of if this is resonated for you or if this is confirmation for you. But yeah, like I was saying, it's King of Wands, I mean, still at the bottom of the deck with uh, Temperance and Queen of Wands. Like I said, whoever you may be, girl or guy, you got it going on. What makes you so good, you also just know how to leave the bullshit behind with the Six of Swords. Like, you don't got time for none of the drama, none of the bullshit, none of that heartbreak, that bullshit people trying to put you through. If they ain't got they ain't got their mind right you're not messing with it but like i said with the six of pentacles like what else also makes you so good is you are a giving person you do give to people as well you do have a giving heart and you know that's what makes you so good and, and people love to give to you as well because they see you out here giving to others and you really doing what you got to do so let's just use some of these cards to clarify all right so now that we have your cards we have potential and we have transition and we have mystery so yes like i was saying just to go in and clarify with this oracle deck of what makes you so good is people see your potential which is basically what I was saying earlier. Like, you're not afraid to take those chances. And, like, you, you go for it with what you want. And you make your moves in silence with the mystery card. You make your moves in silence. Can't nobody know. Can't nobody know what you got going on. Only thing people see you do is when you give to people. Or when you give back. That's it. Like, when you're doing something nice. Other than that, people really don't know nothing more about you. But they see potential in you. They love what you're doing. They like how you're moving with the transition <clears throat> with the transition card as well like i said you transition you walk away from anything that is no longer serving you if it's not making you feel good and it's it sounding like some bullshit like you just ain't got time for it as 111 as i say that in the light click on that's confirmation you moving on with your life like you don't got time for the bullshit People be trying to fuck you over how you heartbroken. No, I'm gonna fuck you breaking those hearts. This is what makes you so good. So, let me just go ahead and get some initials and some descriptions. And then, uh, if this is resonating for you, for clarification. And also, we're going to... With some angel numbers. All right, so we got five. So five, your birthday can be on the fifth of any month. You know, favorite number may be five. Your birthday may be in May. You like the rainbow. Look, we got the rainbow anyway with the sun. I mean, it's sun, not the rainbow, but it got rainbow colors in it. So, it's another kind of confirmation. Like, you be out here shining. That's what else makes you so good. You have a colorful aura around you, and people like that. Or you might like rainbows. You keep your teeth clean. I mean, that should be confirmation for anyone, right? <laughs> baby. Oh, you might be a baby mama, baby daddy watching this. You may be black. You may own a business. Um, you visit a tarot reader, obviously, because you're watching this. You love cats. You may be from Michigan. You may have big hands. People think you have big hands and they find that so good about you. People may love your black skin as well. People may know like you think you're a good baby mama or a baby daddy as well that's what makes you so good as well your name initial can probably start with an i 
people feel like if you um that you own your business you really you do a good job that what else makes you so good you know you keep your teeth clean oh we got moon and star energy like i was saying like you have a mystery to you and you have a star energy to you like you be shining like you got just this mystery around you like I said earlier, it's a mystery around you. People find that so good. You got the letter M again. Um, your name, your initial might start with an M, or you may have a birthday in May. Some of you guys may be tan, or like the color tan. 18th, your birthday can be on the 18th. Or you've been doing some good things for 18 years. You probably are a, um, your initial probably start with an O. Riding does fuck a plug. It says riding does fuck a plug. So you got, like I said, you got potential out here. So people out here seeing you riding on dubs, fuck a plug. Like you don't need connections. Like you doing this on your own. Riding does fuck a plug. I hear that. And some of you guys may be like little, like in weight, probably. People find that so good about you. You may be spontaneous. People like that about you as well. And you're goal oriented. And that what makes you so good. So, yeah, what's this one? Some of you guys may have visited New Jersey or you like New Jersey. That what makes you so good as well. Do a quick angel number for you, and we're gonna end your message for you. Here, what angel number or message do you have for pile one? Keep all your goals and dreams to yourself. Can't make it up. Keep all your goals and dreams to yourself. So that is your messages for pile one. I hope this resonates for you. And if you like this message, make sure to subscribe to this channel. I also do make spell candles as well. This is a Aquarius. This is how it looks on the inside. It smells good. This is for relaxation and intuition. This is my spell candle for real love. This is how this looks inside. It smells good. And trust me, it works because I got a man, y'all. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alrighty, thank you for tuning in. See you guys next time. Bye, we're going to pile two. Alrighty, pile two. For those who chose a green stone, this is your reading on what makes you so good. Okay, thank you guys. Oops, sorry. Thank you guys for clicking on this video. If this message does resonate for you, please like and subscribe to this channel. And I'm just going to go from here. What makes Pile 2 Green Stone so good, Spirit? Alrighty, so Pile 2 Green Stone. What makes you so good? So... The first card that came out for you was the Six of Pentacles. So with the Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups, also with the Magician, these two came out together. But besides all that, with the Six of Pentacles, you are a, um, you have a big heart. You are a giving person. You really give to your community. You really do a lot for people. And with the Three of Pinnacle as well as and people in your community love working with you people want to work with people love how you work so it's just the fact like you um do have a good like a good aura around you like you have a good energy around you where you just want to give to people like because you have a big heart you just want to pour out this love and just show people love this is what makes you so good because you show people love you give love when needed when 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 do when you know you just give it because it's like everybody need love i mean it is what it is and that's how you be moving like you give people you show love you give love people show you love and you know they like you pal too that's what makes you so good people really like you with the ten of pentacles people even like it's people who want to like a man or women whoever like 
they want to build a like a stable family with you or like they see how you can be a good partner with them to build this is what makes you so good or maybe if you're already in a relationship pile to like your partner sees you as a the most stable person they ever encountered with you know came across they they love being around you you do a good job raising the kids like they really care for you and they really want this relationship with you this makes you so good because people really want to be in long-term completed relationships with you with the ten of pentacles and also what makes you so good you have the magician page of wands and the ace of swords so what else makes you so good pile two green stone is you know how to manifest your ass off whatever you say you want whatever you say you gonna do you gonna do that shit and it's gonna happen for you and that's just what it is because you believe in yourself and you know what it is you make shit happen for yourself with the page of wands because you're a creative person you're very smart like you're very intellectual like intellectual intellect yeah, you're very intellect and you know how to, you know, talk that talk and walk that walk. And people can't play you because you're too sharp. Your mind is sharp as fuck. Like, you be, you know, motherfuckers trying to play you. you know, like, motherfuckers, get that shit out of here. Like, but anyway, that's besides the size of point. It's just the fact, you know, you're a very creative person. Like, you dress a different way. The way you dress is still nice. People still like it. It still match. Like, she got red and black shoes on with a, a yellow jacket. And it still look right. Oh, them blue. They blue and red with a yellow jacket. Either way, her outfit kind of cute. <laughs> so you got style. You know, you got some good creativity. So you know how to mix them colors up. You know what you're doing. People like that. That's what makes you so good. Like, you just really out here doing your thing. Pile two. What else makes you so good? Oh, you got the three of swords too. So some of you guys probably have watched pile one. Who knows? Because it's kind of a little bit the same. But yeah, because we got the five of swords and the three of swords at the bottom. So what else makes you so good? Again, like I said, in pile one, it's not so good, but it's good because you may be a very attractive person. Definitely have to be with the magician card, and by people wanting to build families with you, most definitely you're attractive or whatever either way it go you got people that maybe from your past like i said there's some dead shit in the back that is still heartbroken over you or you know or try to fucking play you and you know and you rise above from all that now they all fucked up and conflicted you know trying to figure out dang how do i let this good person go look how that this person is like so creative they have a big heart you know they work they work good with people in the community they give to the community like they, they like damn how how this is this was make you so good because you you don't give a fuck you left all the motherfuckers looking stuck and stupid yeah look you walked away stuck and stupid you ain't got time for no weak ass shit what else makes pal two so good all right i just heard i rock to the beat of my drum sets i've been at the top for a while and i ain't jumped yet uh yeah so you march to the beat of your drum set okay and you do what you do like i said you you a hard worker people love the way you work and you are fair like this what makes you so good like you you work good, you're creative, you're a hard worker, you know how to make that money come in for yourself. And when you do make that money come in, you give it. You I'm not gonna say give it away, but you know how to give. You just you fair. This what makes you so good. Like you got people who be like you ha also have like a, a shadow side to you, but your shadow side is still a fair side. Like you still good. So Pile two. Let's go with some oracle. Just to clarify what else makes you so good. Alrighty. So pile two green green stone. So just to clarify earlier what I was saying, what makes you so good is people love your power. Like I said, you rock to the beat of your drum set. Like, excuse my hand, y'all. That's dumb. <laughs> But um, like I said, you rock to the beat of your drum set. Like you got power. People love your power. People love how you move. Like you are, look, can't make this shit up. 
this is the um ace of swords so it's like you very smart you, you you when you speak it's power when you speak you got power to you and people love that shit that's what makes you so good even if people don't love it that's just what makes you so good like this is what makes you good about yourself you know you have courage again you're not afraid to go after what you want with the eight of pentacles yeah with the eight of pentacles you, you have courage and then you have the justice card like you stand up for people you stand up for what is right you just don't be out here you know just trying to fuck people over because you got power you use your power for the right reasons you know and you also have sexuality to you too so it's just like girl you got the, you the whole package i don't know i was just hearing that i mean girl a guy whoever i'm sorry you just the whole package and you got it going on you got it going on transition at the bottom of the deck i don't know but you got it going on pile two green stone like you got courage like you move how you want to move when you do move you move with gracious like with with love you don't you just don't move in no no grimy shit you move with love and people love that about you that's why people want to work with you that's why people be asking to work with you like people fuck with you how to all right so we just gonna get some um Yeah, we're going to get some angel numbers real quick. I mean, just the angel number or some type of guidance on what you need to hear. It says, I am divinely protected. So, at the end of the day, when you speak your power and how you move with your, how you, when you move, when you move, it's just the fact you good no matter what. You got God, spirit, universe behind you at all times. So move how you want to move. You divinely protected, baby. So speak your truth, speak your power, because you got a mission out here I'm seeing, because I'm seeing like microphones and pinnacles and stuff like, and manifestations. We got the eight of pinnacles, which is about word. We got the magician, three of pinnacles, 10 of pinnacles, of, six of pinnacles. And then also I did the prosperity is near you. <laughs> Prosperity abundance almost came out seeing that too for pile two. Alright, so let's just get some quick initials and some descriptions if this is for you, if this is confirmation for you, okay? Alrighty guys, so now that we have some initials out and just some short descriptions of if this resonates for you for confirmation. So we have manipulator. So what makes you so good is you can peep out a manipulator at any time. Like like I said, you, you walk away from motherfuckers with the three of swords. I'm not about to pull this card out. Oh, I'll pull it out. Three of swords. You walk away from motherfuckers because you know how you got the power. And you know how to, you know, get over a manipulator. So that one makes you so good. You can be very talkative. So this can make you so good as well. People like that about you. Or this is, you know, this again, this is what makes you so good. Fuck what everybody else thinks. So you might be like light brown, you know, and you may love dogs. Um, we have 11, so your birthday may be on the 11th, your date of birth, I mean, you know, your initial may be T, maybe a little, just a little chunky, you know, just a little on the chunky side. You may smoke weed, you know. You may like the rainbows. Your initial may be Y. We got Y, G, E, L, R, N. Um, we have 21, 22. For your, um, in the number two. For your date of birth, your, you know, your birthday can fall on one of those days. Um, you may have braids in your hair. Or you like braids. You, um, of course, like the beach. Um, let's see, you like fancy car, cars, you've been to ATL, um, what else makes you good? It says, you know, it says he likes to eat that pussy from the back, so what makes you so good is, like, your girl, of course, your guy likes to eat that pussy from the back, like I said, yo, 
you know, if you're in a relationship, your person or you guy, the guy, you probably like to eat that pussy from the back, you know, because again, you, excuse my language, but that's just what's coming now on the, the on here. And, um, yeah, y'all are some freaky motherfuckers. We got the magician out here too, anyway. So, um, you like music? Y'all will make sure so good, or you may be good at music. You have no hoes because you don't need no hoes, you know? You may have short hair as well. That one makes you so good. And yeah, so pile two, this is your reading. I hope this resonates. Some of you guys may be young. Some of you guys may have curly hair as well, or you are young spirited. That one makes you so good. And some of you guys may have been in Tennessee. And yeah, some of you guys live with your partner and they think you a good person. That one makes you so good. So pile two. Um, Greenstone, this is your reading. I hope this resonates for you. Also, I make spell candles. This is the Aquarius relaxation and intuition. Don't mind the label right now. This is how it looks on the inside. It smells really good. So this is, um, you know, spell candles, a relaxation, relaxation and intuition. Then we have um, the real love, which is a love candle spell. This is how it looks on the inside. So pretty. It smells so pretty. Alrighty, guys, thank you for watching. If this message resonate, sorry, if this message resonate for you, please like and subscribe to this channel and share. And thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. Alrighty, last but not least, pile three. If you chose this pink crystal stone, it's so pretty. This is your reading on what makes you so good, so good, so good. And see, I didn't even sing on the other two piles, so I know you're really so good, so good. <laughs> Ding on that one, okay? Alrighty, so pile three, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for clicking on this video. If these messages resonate for you, please like and subscribe to this channel. So we're just going to go in what makes you so good. Okay, so we have Ace of Swords. What makes pal three pink stones so good? Alrighty, so pal three pink stone. What makes you so good? With the seven of swords, some of you probably watched um, pal one, but hey. But anyway, with the seven of swords. Again, I'm getting you don't take no bullshit from people and you move in silence as well too. Like with the chariot as well. Sorry. With the chariot. You moving. You moving on in silence. You moving to your accomplishments. Like you're not you're not caring what people have to say. You're leaving people behind. You're leaving all that, that fake shit behind. This is what makes you so good, Pile 3. Like you know how to leave fake shit behind and you is leaving fake shit behind right now as we speak. So good for you with the seven of swords. Keep doing you. Keep moving in silence. Just keep on moving away from people who no longer serve you. Like who gives I don't give a fuck if it's even your man or your your peoples, whoever the fuck it may be. If they causing you to be in the eight of swords, like conflicted, not knowing which decision to go and what to make in life, you you need to move on because you can easily do that with no problem. Okay, but that's just a side note. But Anywho, what else makes you so good, pile three, uh, clear st pink stone, is we have the full with the ace of cups. Now, with the full ace of cups, you know how to go after your passions in life. You know how to just go for what it is that you want in life and just take that leap of faith because this is what is your calling, you know. This is like how you feel inside. And some of you guys are doing this right now as we speak. And it's just a fact this is making you so good because you're living out your life purpose with the will of fortune. Like good shit is coming your way, baby. If you don't have it now, it's coming to you. Believe mm, believe it. Just believe it. Look, I don't know what I'm talking about. Believe it. It's coming. You waiting on it. You know it's coming because you putting in that work. 
with the eight of swords i mean with the um ace of swords also with the justice like you got new beginnings coming for you when it comes to any new like project new career whatever you're trying to do in life because i'm getting some of you guys may want to start doing your career in like in the justice field so and you know you got to be smart as hell and some of you guys are smart as hell you know it's different type of smarts don't think you just got to be all book smarts to just work in the justice system because no you don't but we ain't gonna go there but this one makes you so good because also people may find you to be very balanced in life they like how you move they think you're a fair person they think that i mean well we're not saying nay this is what makes you so good what makes you so good is you are a fair person you have a balance in your life you know how to balance out your emotions your good and your bad your dark your good side you know we all got it to us you know so it's just the fact you know how to use it when it's needed because you just ain't for the bullshit. Like you, you take up for people, you know, you're very smart and your mouth is very sharp. It's, you know, so of course with a sharp brain, you got a sharp mouth and people don't like that. But at the end of the day, this what makes you so good because you that motherfucker out here. You, you that chick. I mean, I'm not necessarily calling you that. It's just how I speak. Okay. So let's see. What else makes Pow three so good? We got the Knight of Swords, the Strength, and the Judgment. Yeah, like I was saying, like you just have the strength to just go for whatever you want in life. This is what makes you so good. You don't hold nobody up. You charging. You going fast speed. It's like you running after a motorcycle. So come on now. Everybody know you can't run. I mean, I'm... I mean, you can run after a motorcycle. He doing it, but it's just y'all know motorcycles are fast, and it's like nobody's riding it. So it's like you trying to, you no know, trying, but you going for what you want and like what you need, and you know you need that motorcycle because you tired of running. You know you want to just go for your passion in life, and you do that, and you know, full space. You have the strength, you know, you have the strength to do this. And that's what makes you so good because can't nobody knock you down. You got people who try to walk all over you, try to think you were weak, try to play you. Like with the judgment card. <laughs> you know, motherfuckers try to walk all over you, try to play you like you was weak. But guess what? Karma's on your side with the judgment card. You got the justice and the judgment. Motherfuckers can't fuck with you. They can't fuck with you. This is what makes you so good because can't nobody fuck with you, literally. Even when they try to, when they think they won. Like I said, karma is on your side. Can't nobody fuck with you. So we just, yeah. Still cherry at the bottom. You got some big money coming your way, power three. This is what makes you so good. Or it's like I said, you're like, you know how to go for that money. Whichever way you you going. You running, you taking your leash of faith, you moving in silence. And you, you just got it going on. So, yeah, this one makes you so good. So, we're going to go in with some Oracle decks. Want some Oracle decks. We're going to go in with the Oracle deck just to clarify what else makes you so good. And just to confirm that for you with some initials and short descriptions. So, let's see what makes Pal 3 so good. Alrighty. So, Pal 3 Pink Stone. We have transition, we have fight, and we have peace. I can't make this sh up, guys. I can't make it up. So transition was the first card to come out. So again, like I said, you know how to just go for what you want. Like, you know how to just make those moves. Like, like whatever. Yeah, like, you just be like, whatever. I'm going. I'm just going you like you you know how to get out your comfort zone you don't stay in one spot you don't stay stuck you know how to transition and move around you, you listen to you what your ancestors is telling you you know and you just go with the flow in life and that's what makes you so good because you know how to transition and move around with no problems you just go go with the flow with the full you you know how to you fight for for what's right like i said you have balanced i mean you have um yeah you have balance to you but you have fairness to you and you fight for people um oh just like i was saying earlier with the um yeah you got the justice and the insta sword like i was saying and with the judgment some of y'all probably are going to go into some type of leadership where it involves you speaking up for people with the fight 
this what makes you so good or maybe some of you guys are already in this type of field where you stand up and fight for people like just fight for what's right and you speak the truth and this what makes you so good and people some people don't like that like i said you speak the truth and like this one makes you so good but at the end of the day you still peace so you still got love for people come on now you still a happy go lucky chick you're peaceful you probably like some type of hippie almost you have a, like a unique style to you but at the end of the day you got it going on people fuck with you you know you are a peaceful person girl or guy you know, you just you putting it out there in the world and you just waiting for everything to come back into your favor. And I say, because like you, when you move, you move with love. But even though it's in silence, you're moving with love and peace. And you got two aces out here. So that's confirmation right there for what I was saying. Where some of you guys may be like in the medical, I mean, not medical, but some in the medical field because you know you help people in the medical field. But I was thinking more like in the, um, justice field so we was gonna go in with some um some guidance cards i'm sorry not so we're just gonna go in with some angel numbers or a message from your angels so what does pile three pink stone needs to hear what message do you have for pile three pink stone spirit? What makes them so good? Or what do they need to hear? It says, return all negative energy back to sender. Like I said, can't make that shit up, people. It's the reason why I keep saying people don't like you for that. People don't like you. So at the end of the day, you're still so good. But like I was saying, people are not going to like how you stand up for what's right like i said you have a fight and so that means people are gonna be sending negative energy towards you so it's important that you turn that shit back yeah you may be peace but at the end of the day you got to protect your peace okay all right so let's just go on with some initials just to clarify if this is message for you or if it resonates um just for more confirmation for you Alrighty, so pile three, pink stone. I don't know why I'm so happy, happy on y'all last pile. Maybe y'all like in a happy mood and that's really good and I really love that. So this is some initials for you or some descriptions of if this is fitting for you or if this confirmation for you. So what else makes you so good? But first, before we go, what else makes you go so good? We have numbers 5, 31, 13, 3. Um, yeah, so your birthday could be on the 5th, the 31st, or the 13th, or the 1st of any month. Or you could be 31 as well. Because I'm pretty sure I know 13, one year old is watching this shit. But anywho, um, or your birthday, yeah. So we have X like the letter x c the letter c um so your initial could be x or c um people love that you are good with family this will make you so good you love your family or you know how to take care of your family really good so that what else makes you so good um fighter abuser you um you know how to stand like i said with the fight you stand up for people who've been through like domestic type of involvements so yeah, I don't know what else. I don't know really what I can say on here, but I ain't try to say that. But uh, it says I'm living good, book the hood, okay? Because at the end of the day, you are living good, all right? You doing you like I said. You putting in that work and you waiting for your, you waiting for your dreams to manifest for you. You did what you did. Everything gonna come for you. You may like um, color orange. Orange may look good on you. That one, that up. What else may be good for you? You may be a good mother or father. That one makes you so good. You may be good with your business as business owner. So you may be a good business owner, or you have want to own a business, or you have a business. You like to drink, or you're good at making drinks. You know, um, people always try to love bomb you, so you can sniff out a love bomber in a motherfucking second. 
and you might have green eyes and you love cats so pile three pink stone this is what i have for you if this message resonates please like and subscribe to the channel i also make spell candles this is the aquarius candle it smells good and it looks good as well and it definitely manifests whatever you need this is the love candle okay and it works okay so thank you guys for tuning in to sweet coconut entertainment i'm your host i'm enjoy k and see you guys next time make sure to subscribe to this page appreciate you